Hey guys, welcome back. And if you're new here, welcome. My name is Lisa. On this channel, we focus on luxury, fashion, beauty, fragrance, and lifestyle. So if you happen to like any of those things, I'd love it if you would consider subscribing to my channel. Come back and visit me and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified each time a video is uploaded here on this channel. So today, yes, your girl is doing it again. <laughs> We are out here blind buying. I don't know. This behavior has got to stop. But anyway, I purchased another one. I can't remember what I was doing, but somehow this flashed across my computer screen or my phone. And I took notice because, as you guys remember, I recently uploaded a video on a few blind buy fragrances I did. It was a designer fragrance haul I believe yeah and I purchased two of the other ones in this line and I was pleasantly surprised and I'm talking about none other than the Oscar de la Renta line that's been around for quite a while but I never purchased it I'm mad at myself that I didn't so we have this one in this beautiful bottle with the beautiful white flowers I'm just a sucker for the packaging and it has a top, but I can't find it. I don't know where it is. It's around here somewhere, but yeah. Anyway, and then there's this one with the pink. So that's how it's supposed to look with the top. But anyway, I don't know what I did with it at the moment. Pleasantly surprised with both of these. This one has more of a white floral vibe going on. This one has a little bit more rose. But I love both of them. Just gorgeous. And yeah very pleasantly surprised so when I saw this one in the gold packaging I already opened it so we don't have to deal with the plastic and I wanted to show it to you guys on my Instagram stories so I did take it out but I haven't smelled it but I wanted to see the bottle and take a picture of it for you guys I was attracted because it's gold and we love the color gold here <laughs> so I had to buy it to go along with the other two since I actually like those so much. So here we have this beautiful gold bottle. Love it. I got this in the smaller size. This is a 1 ounce or 30 ml. These are the 3.4 ounces or 100 ml. But you know me, I like to buy the smaller bottles because I have way too much fragrance. And it's just more... It's just better because I'm not going to use all of this whole bottle. Like, I can't remember the last time I used a whole bottle of fragrance. It's so sad. I don't know. If I could just become a signature scent girl, <laughs> I could do a lot better, but I just can't do it. I just, I can't. <laughs> I don't know. There's always something new and fabulous coming out, and I have to smell it and have all of them. All the good smelling stuff. So, anyway, can't really smell anything off the top of this bottle. As you can see on these, it has more of a frosted see-through glass. And on these, the packaging is opaque. Same for the white. So I just wanted to point that out. So let's get to sniffing this. I do not know what the notes are. have no idea. I literally just bought it because it was gold packaging. And it went with these other two. And I like them, so I figured... Hey, why not buy it? And we are going to see what this smells like. So, all right, let's spray. Got a test strip here. Very nice atomizer. So, hmm, I like this. <laughs> smells good in the air, actually, from what I'm smelling. It smells different from the other ones, actually, too. So, yeah, it smells actually quite, I'm not going to say quite a bit different, but it does smell different. I'm going to spray some on my skin. I'm going to have this be my scent of the night since after this video, I'm going to get in the bed, take these clothes off, wash my face, wash this makeup off. And this is going to be my scent of the night for bedtime. Somebody <laughs> said to me, uh, I never thought about wearing fragrance to bed. I do it all the time. I've done it for years and years and years, as long as I can remember. I just love it. And it's also a good way to test out fragrances if you want to test something out. 
but you don't want to go out into the world because you're not sure about it. But anyway, it's just so comforting. It's just something about it. So anyway, um, this smells really good in the air. Uh, let's see. So it has kind of like a deeper scent. Not very floral. Like these are more of a floral scent. The white one and the pink one. This is more of a... It has a slight sweetness to it. A slight floral kick, but it's not super floral. And it has more of a creamy vibe to it and a deeper vibe than the other two. So... I'm going to say it smells like it has like a little bit of sweetness, maybe some type of berries or something, and then maybe some mandarin. Definitely has some floral in here, so probably smells like a little bit of rose. I don't know, maybe some type of white flower. And then, also definitely smells like it has some vanilla in here and some musk. But most fragrances, a lot of them have musk, so I'm going to guess musk and maybe some type of ambroxan and maybe some type of woods. I don't know. So, anyway, let's just see actually what the notes are in here. Let me pull up Fragrantica. Wow. <laughs> Fragrantica. Wow. It actually doesn't have the notes listed. Are you kidding me? How? How was that possible on Fragrantica? <sighs> okay. Um, let me go with um backup number two. <laughs> Let's see where I can find these notes. And I am on the Oscar de la Renta dot com site with the Bella essence on here and it gives me the details so it says that this is luminous and enchanting like a beautiful flower from Oscar's garden she evokes the timeless feelings of falling in love enhanced with rose vanilla and jasmine undertones okay <laughs> so this it was released sometime this year maybe a little bit earlier this year or Maybe a few months ago. I'm not exactly sure, but I'm just seeing it pop up. I just saw it pop up on my phone or my computer. The notes are, top notes are grapefruit. I didn't mention that. It has raspberry and red currant, so yeah. I did mention red berries, so those are the two red berries. I tend to like raspberry on my skin in a fragrance for some reason it just kind of vibes with my skin pretty well uh yeah middle notes are rose centrifolia so there's a rose it does have vanilla and jasmine petal so that's the white flower is jasmine so it had some type of white flower so that's it. Middle notes, rose, vanilla, and jasmine. And then the heart notes are musk, ambroxan, and patchouli. Hey, I did pretty good. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I actually like this. Um, this is kind of a different take. So it's a little bit deeper, a little bit creamier, not so floral, and it's not very sweet. Kind of a mixture of all of those. So, very, it's a very nice fragrance. I like it. Happy I got it to add to my collection of them. So, now I have a trio. So, that is Oscar de la Renta's Bella Essence. Let me know if you have this. This is a good uh, for fall scent, but it's actually a very good year round scent. This one, I would say, is more of someone's signature scent, but this is a very nice take. Oh. Hey. Eh. Your girl is out here almost <laughs> killing it. Oh, sorry. Sorry, baby. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, it's not broken, thank goodness. It's a nice take on these little deeper scent if you don't like 
really floral scents. But yeah, it's nice. So definitely check this out. I'm really happy that I got it to go along with the rest of my Bella fragrances here in my collection. If you guys have this, let me know what your thoughts are. And as always, in any of my fragrance videos, I like to know what you guys are wearing. So let me know in the comments section below. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. I am Lisa. I am totally addicted to fragrances. I'd love to have you back and part of my YouTube family here. So please consider subscribing and look what I got you guys in the mail today. If you recognize the emblem, this is from Gallagher Fragrances and I just got it today. So I'll try to share it with you guys on a later video. So be on the lookout for that. So thanks again for watching you guys. I really appreciate you being here. Have an amazing day and amazing week and amazing month and an amazing rest of 2020. And I will see you guys on the next video.